<laughs> My goal is to make sure you talk to at least 10 people today in front of me. Okay. Now, all you gotta do is get out, hi, I'm Wayne, I'm with Meineke. As long as you get those two out and I close it, it's yours. If I start it, it's mine. Oh, really? But if you start it. Well, I'll start all of them. <laughs> you I mean, I'm, I'm, you, <laughs> you gotta shadow me for at least, at least an hour. Oh, okay. <laughs> No, they're my favorite. <laughs> the scariest thing is probably I have no concept of what it is to go door to door. And so uh, yeah, I'm not too scared, but that would be the, the scariest thing to me. Now, the beginning of the day, usually there's not a whole lot of people home. You get all like the retired folks out of the way, the stay at home moms that don't make decisions or you know, parents or whatever. Instead of the coupons in the mail, they sent us. We're just, you know, harder to put in the trash. Yeah, you're a much better looking guy, so I'll tell you. Thank you very much. I haven't heard that in maybe, I've never heard that. <laughs> um, well, uh, if we had an amazing value on your oil changes to come try up a local mechanic, is that something that you would make a decision on, or is that like a hubby department? Mm -hmm. you know, yes, hubby department? Exactly. Is he around by chance? No, not yet. No. The time is. <laughs> Totally a husband's deal. Um, so if I had a really awesome value, that would be totally his department. It would. It would. Is he home by chance? No, he isn't. So kid, can the kitty go out? If they say no. I'll be like, okay, I can't do this. Closer. Please close up for me. <laughs> Hello. How are you? Okay, good. It's it's nothing serious at all. We're just. Out. Hey, how's it going? Alright, it's nothing serious. We're... And then you want to know the best thing about the whole card? Sure. It's pretty amazing. This makes everybody run for their checkbook. It's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It comes with me. So oh. you can always remember me coming by. I can even wow. sign it. <laughs> How many vehicles do you guys have? Okay. Alright, you have a good day, sir. <laughs> Not the happiest gentleman. Hello. Hi, it's nothing serious. Sorry to catch you right when you're pulling up. And uh, you kind of got to pace yourself a little bit. You don't want to go too much at the very beginning of the day because most of your money-making time is at the end of the night. That's when all the breadwinners and decision-makers get home. And so usually when, like, 5, five to 6 o'clock pick up, right around those hours, usually when you'll see me pick up the pace and start walking a lot quicker. So I walk quick anyway, so you guys will have fun trying to keep up with me. Well, if we walk too quick, I'm going to have some chafing issues. They figure that deciding to spend $10 a change doesn't break that original agreement. And so a lot of people just make a decision on behalf of the household to save the household money and pick it up from you. Mm -hmm. And I'm not doing this. Uh -huh. um, but there is actually one more thing that I ask you to throw on your end of the deal. Okay. If you could, along with the check for the $79.95, do you suppose you could throw in like maybe a small glass of water for me? The most supportive person was my wife, Pam. She's behind it. She knows that... Uh, I kind of trust God in my decisions I make in my life, and when I felt that that was the leading, she was behind 100%. Plus, uh, she started adding up some numbers, and uh, I came here one day with her, and the salesman talked about how much money he made that day, and she said, why don't you start today? So she's, a, she's excited about the possibilities financially, but uh, she's always been supportive of what I like to do. Turf management is the most important um, thing you can do, and fill out your res report accurately. Because at the end of the night, the reason we actually keep them is so we can sit down and see what you need help with. Now that coach is on board, he's probably going to be doing a lot of that, Mr. Inspirator. Sorry, I said I got to call. Is that you a bad something. word? What is that? Is that <laughs> inspirator is that bad? No, it's actually oh. a good thing. Every time you come here, I, I, I've been waiting for this day for ever since I found out you were coming on board with us. Thank you. I hope one day that I get to go knock some doors with you. If you have a piss poor attitude, you're not gonna make very many sales. And a lot of people do a whole bunch of different things to actually keep your attitude mess out. I whistle, he skips. Um, one day. <laughs> 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 you guys, have you ever seen a fat man skip? <laughs>
thought it was great. It cheered me right up. And I think when people invest their life in somebody else or some some other thing, it's it's the best thing. Mind if I give my my life principle? Please do. The Nelson Life Principle is living is growing, and you grow to help other people grow. And so not only should you grow every day in your life, but then you grow the purpose is to help somebody else grow, to take them and get them to a place. So I think this business does that.